Alrighty. Hello, bases. Your kings have arrived. Wildband here. And Brian. And we are back with Batman the Animated Series. First note, yeah, it's different. We've uh, changed the camera setup. We've actually got posters up here in the background, so it's a little <laughs> more lively than just, uh... Was it not I, recording before? I didn't hit record yet. I'm going to try that again. Well, there you go. <laughs> Good thing you put your hand up. Uh, yes. <laughs> Hit record here, but not record there. That's funny. All right. Alrighty. Hello, bases. Your kings have arrived. Wild Band here. And Brian. And we are back with Batman the Animated Series. First off, finally different. Yep. We got the camera in a new place. We got posters up finally over these bare white walls. So it's a little more lively here. In the, in the... Trying to keep you on your toes there. Yes. And second... I loved last week's episodes. I know. It, that, he's one of my favorite Batman villains, as I've stated before. Oh, yeah. You can see why. I will say, both with uh, the Two-Face episode and the Clayface episode, I found the first episode the stronger of the two, but by no means was the second episode bad. I agree 100%. Um, I put uh, both the first parts of those two on my good list. I'm keeping a list of all the good episodes and all the bad ones. <laughs> Yes. So far, there's only two bad ones that I've had. <laughs> and I know one of them that the, the I called it Joker's Pun Palooza. <laughs> yes, I, I did not like that one as much. <laughs> they can't all be solid gold. Yes. Know? Hopefully, the same can't be said for today's episode, Fear of Victory. Now, just based on the uh, thumbnail we have and the title, I'm assuming A, we have Scarecrow back. Based on the fear thing, yeah. B, be. Robin's in this episode. <laughs> I don't remember how they introduced Robin. It just seems like he's there. So kind of hoping they do because I do love his origin story. And then like, there's so many different variations, but it's always like, oh, orphan from a circus, basically. <clears throat> I do remember that later on we get Nightwing. Yes. Um, and we get I think it's Timothy Drake, Robin. Tim Drake, yeah. Later on, so because I'm pretty sure this is Dick Grayson. I think you're right. Yeah. Well, let's uh, find out which Robin we got here. Brian, hit play. All right. Oh yeah, this is this is definitely Scarecrow back. Yep, he's right there. <laughs> <laughs> Looks a little different from the character animation, but maybe he gets an anime, like a design upgrade this time around. I don't know. I can't wait for you to see his redesign later on. It's pretty awesome. All right, pretty creepy. His performance this weekend against that tough tech team. All but Are you totally Rogers thinking of Cyborg also? Yeah. <laughs> I'm betting on it. A fan. As I said, weird. Gee, I wonder who wrote that. I don't know. Uh, maybe Penguin. Could it be this guy right here? No, not possible. Come on, Brian. Get it together. Now, is this Dick Grayson, or is this random college friend 47? Oh, all right, it all looks right. like Dick Grayson. Uh, let, let's try a run. Off tackle. But I don't think this guy is supposed to be to the guy who becomes cyborg. Uh, uh, yeah. Yeah, okay. No, this isn't uh, yeah, Victor. Vic yeah, I'm blanking okay, on him. Victor. Man? Victor something. Yeah, yeah. Victor Stone. No, no Victor problem. Stone, yeah. Ah, no! Don't hurt me! Don't hurt me! Was there like some sort of like fear thing on the ticket? I don't know, but then he would have been. It must maybe in the helmet? <laughs> No, it can't be the helmet. They were so. And and what would Scarecrow have to benefit? It was unbelievable, Batman. From this. The guy totally no freaked idea. right there on the field. Brian Robin. Oh, he's he's just world. he's Robin already. A lot of pressure, Robin. What? You can never tell what. Uh, okay, he's just there now. Like, like Harley Quinn, she was just there. Yeah. Now, granted, she does get a later um, episode explaining herself, but. Uh -oh. I'm kind of hoping the same with Robin now. We've gone 18 episodes where Batman's flying solo, and then Robin's there. Right. Oh, <gasps> uh, maybe he's now starting to feel the effects. Maybe you're right, it was on the ticket. It, has, it had to have been, what else? <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> <laughs> hey boy blunder What's I do not matter? remember that Bat got your tongue <laughs> no, You're gonna take got care you. of bird boy Now 
will be he be affected because he's wearing gloves? Ah, there was there, there was some sort of like substance on this. Yeah, a screwy telegram. This one's not. Oh, a take rat. it easy, fella. Or was it? This one's not a rat. Oh, remember from the Batman? It's not a rat. I suspect the chemical is absorbed through the skin. Oh, they're doing animal testing. Don't lick it. Oh no, it's it's got sniffed too close. Nothing's <clears throat> happening. So whenever you or Brian or any of the other athletes got agitated, the stuff kicks so in, turning our excitement to fear. It seems like it. But how long is this gonna last? But why target him? I'm still? afraid there's only one person who can answer that: the Professor of Fear himself, the Scarecrow. Jonathan Crane. Oh, can't be. He's locked up in Arkham. Isn't he? I wonder now, though, is it a dummy in Arkham or is it a copycat? We'll find out. It's a good question, because we never saw him, just in the shadow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Looks like uh, Chris Farley's lunch lady. <laughs> yeah. Sloppy Joe, slop, sloppy Joe. Professor Crane lost his appetite. Oh, that was awesome. Yeah, he lurks in the shadows. And Robin. Yeah, and then there's Robin. <laughs> but the scarecrow and Robin's is there. Uh, what what do you mean? <laughs> He's in the cell. I'd like to be sure of that. Take he comes out of the shower, I, Robin's just I like, just saw him Hi everybody. <laughs> he won't mind if I pay him a visit. No! Holy no, crap, Tiles Batman, it's, this it's case is creepy. <laughs> You don't put your hands on the Batman. Oh! Hi! The cowl is familiar, but I'm blanking on the face. <laughs> oh! Some cameos here. But to be fair, he just got her a couple episodes ago, so it makes sense that they're both here. Yep. And... And him too. Yeah, he broke out. He turned into a real scarecrow. It's the fear of victory and the agony. Yeah. The scarecrow. Whoa! So now you understand <coughs> step one in how I fix an athletic contest. I shall proceed to step two. No! No! Get away! <laughs> And interesting that the, it's it's already a different look, like not even like ten episodes since his first appearance. Yeah. No, I'm not afraid. Man, this stuff not lasts for a while. Afraid. Yeah. I'm not. No. Hey, cha cha. Hey, ba Batman, you have an antidote for no, wait, does he? I learned to walk on. Did he find? Wire. You would think he would no, just I can't have stand it. On I thought he had it in the last freaking. episode, or did he just I'm, beat it? I'm no good to you anymore. Easy, Dick. I don't remember. It's bound to wear off. But in the meantime, you've got to fight it. Yeah. I think he just. Would, I think fought. he just fought it off last time. I don't yeah. think there was a, a cure. You think he would I come up with a catch cure? A game tonight. Drive real slow. Well, he wasn't kidding. I was half expecting <laughs> to peel right out of there. Exactly. Batman! <laughs> Holy speeding ticket, Batman! <laughs> Telegram for Mitch Knoll. No! What? What's wrong? All I did was double talk. I'll move it, I swear! <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I wonder if the people in this universe know who Robin is. Like if like how like how recent he came into Batman's like partnership. I was half expecting those two guys. Like, uh, to be You're like, Robin! Yeah, to be like, oh, you got a sidekick now, or something like that. <gasps> so he rips off his mask for another mask. Should be frustrating himself. Did Robin get to him in time? Change of luck, Scarecrow. I think so. Or did Batman, or, or, or was it on the ticket? And You're Batman just stopped the ticket. Is illegal in Gotham. I think Robin I noticed the money. one helmet that was you know the different from the others. It was upside days. down. Right. And it will and take I much more than this to together. bring every pathetic no closer, Batman. 
Unless you want a stampede of half crazed I want another rendition of this live other. action. Oh, no. Ooh. We got a little bit in Batman Begins. Yeah, even though, like, unfortunately, Scarecrow was just a, a secondary yeah, villain. Great. Rachel Ghoul was the main villain. I know. We only got, like, two scenes with him, you know? And then, like, little snippets now, of the Dark Knight and Dark Knight Returns. What guarantee do I have you will? Disaster for Gotham! Please, please Wait, catch it. Look at that! <laughs> Good work, Robin. I also snagged a helmet that had some of this in it. Shut up, Robin. Looks like you got a handle on your problem. So it was it was yeah. Robin who saved the day. Yeah. The Gotham Knights wasted. I love that all that happened Brian and the, the public had no, no idea that it was first going round on. Draft pick. Looks like your friend is back on track again. Yeah, I can't wait to congratulate him. You can always send a telegram. <laughs> oh! That felt like a really quick episode. It did. Like, I know we like saw the middle point when, uh, when it went to black at Arkham, but still, that felt very quick. I think because stuff was happening just all the time. There was very little in between that was just downtime, you yeah. know? Like, once it set up what was happening, it was just go, go, go. I wouldn't put it on my best list, but it was entertaining. I, yeah, I really liked that one. And I love Scarecrow's redesign. That looks really creepy and really good. <laughs> I just, I, I love that he doesn't need muscle in order to beat Batman, you know? I just think that's so cool. Yeah. I, mean, I, think, I think that Arkham scene was... It's a nice little, little cherry yep. on this episode. And, you know, they can do that without providing any voice work, and it's a nice little cameo for us. I mean, know? yes, we had Mark Hamill speaking had like him, yeah. two lines right there, but still. We, we'll take it. Uh, uh, Two-Face, Joker, uh, po Poison Ivy. Ivy yeah. So far, all the villains he's faced up against. That's true, yeah. Didn't see Clock King, but we don't, still don't know his fate. I think he escaped. We didn't see Clayface in there either. No, did he we didn't. Yeah, no, he, he escaped, did. didn't yeah. he? Well, he, uh, they thought he was dead, yeah. and then he, like, he showed up at the end with those yellow that's eyes right, and that yeah. one. Oh, that was, yeah, that's a good ending. Yeah, that was that was a really good episode. I liked that one a lot. Kind of a lackluster introduction for Robin. I know, like with both, no with both Harley Quinn and Robin, they're just, bam, right there in the show already. So, I, I know that Harley Quinn was originally created to be like just like a, a female Joker, basically. Yeah, but like a like a side character, almost not like they did not intend her to be the like phenom that she is now. Mm -hmm. You know, I think that's just the audience loved her. So I think that first episode was more like that. I think that's what they were intending her like to oh, be. Like a side character, like an assistant or something. But then know? people were like, "Bring back Harley Quinn!" Like, I think so. Okay. Make her an origin. Make her an origin. Okay. <laughs> but like Robin has like decades of comic book history. And, and we got like small hints of that. Like, oh, like that, that was fine at the circus. Can we see that? Yeah, maybe we will. I, I would love to. Because I like Robin as a character. Yeah, I, I like that too. I, you know, it's it's easy to make fun of that. But I, I like him as a character too. I like when he grows up to become Nightwing. And, yes. You know. And I know he's usually like the boy wonder. He's in college. <laughs> yeah. So he's the young man wonder. <laughs> yep. Which makes sense because if he's growing up, you know, we'll see him as Nightwing eventually. Yes. Um, but yeah, fantastic episode. I would probably put it in like a top 10. I don't know about a top 5, but definitely a top 10 so far. I'd agree with that. But uh, tune in next time for some more Batman adventures. But until then, thank you all so much for watching. Hit that like button, hit subscribe, help the channel grow. Hit that little notification bell so you know when we do more reactions like this and when I upload my other videos. Your kings are departing.